Egyptian mythology is one of the most fascinating and complex systems of beliefs in the ancient world. It features a rich pantheon of gods and goddesses, each with their own stories, attributes, and roles in the cosmic order. In this video, we will explore some of the essential deities in Egyptian mythology and their relationships with each other, as well as some of the lesser known but still important ones. Are, the sun god. Are is the supreme god of the Egyptian pantheon, the creator of everything and the source of life. He is often depicted as a falcon-headed man wearing a sun disc on his head, or as a sun boat traveling across the sky. Are is the father of many other gods, such as Shu, Tefnut, Geb, Nut, Osiris, Isis, Seth, and Nephthys. He is also associated with the pharaohs, who were considered his earthly representatives. Horus, the sky god. Horus is the son of Osiris and Isis, and the god of the sky, kingship, and protection. He is usually portrayed as a falcon or a falcon-headed man wearing a double crown that symbolizes his rule over Upper and Lower Egypt. Horus is famous for his battle with his uncle Seth, who killed his father Osiris and tried to usurp the throne. Horus eventually defeated Seth and avenged his father, becoming the rightful king of Egypt. Osiris, the god of the underworld. Osiris is the god of the underworld, resurrection, and fertility. He is depicted as a mummified man wearing a white crown with feathers and holding a crook and a flail. Osiris was originally a king of Egypt who taught his people agriculture and civilization. He was murdered by his brother Seth, who cut his body into pieces and scattered them across the land. His wife Isis collected his remains and used her magic to revive him. Osiris then became the ruler of the afterlife, where he judged the souls of the dead. Isis, the goddess of magic. Isis is the goddess of magic, healing, motherhood, and protection. She is portrayed as a woman wearing a throne-shaped headdress or a vulture cap with cow horns and a sun disc. Isis is the wife and sister of Osiris and the mother of Horus. She is known for her devotion to her husband whom she resurrected with her magic after Seth's murder. She is also revered as a powerful sorceress who can manipulate the forces of nature and the fate of mortals. Seth, the god of chaos. Seth is the god of chaos, storms, violence, and deserts. He is represented as a man with the head of an unidentified animal, sometimes called the Seth animal. Seth is the brother and rival of Osiris, whom he killed out of jealousy and ambition. He also fought with Horus for the throne of Egypt, but was eventually defeated and banished to the desert. Seth is not always evil, however. He also has a role in maintaining the balance between order and chaos, and he helps Are fight against the serpent Apep every night. Anubis, the god of mummification. Anubis is the god of mummification, embalming, and funerary rites. He is shown as a man with the head of a jackal or as a full jackal. Anubis is the son of Osiris and Nephthys, who disguised herself as Isis to seduce him. Anubis helped Isis to reassemble Osiris' body after Seth's attack. He also invented the process of mummification to preserve the corpses of the dead. Anubis guides the souls of the deceased to the underworld, where he weighs their hearts against a feather to determine their fate. Batet, the goddess of cats. Batet is the goddess of cats, fertility, music, and joy. She is depicted as a woman with the head of a cat or as a full cat. Batet is the daughter of Are and the wife of Ta, the god of craftsmen. She is associated with both healing and destruction, as she can protect her devotees from diseases and evil spirits, but also unleash her wrath on those who harm cats or offend her. Batet was very popular among the ancient Egyptians, who kept cats as pets and revered them as sacred animals. Ta, the god of craftsmen. Ta is the god of craftsmen, architects, and artists. He is shown as a man wrapped in a tight-fitting cloth, holding a staff that combines the symbols of life, stability, and power. Ta is the creator of the world and everything in it, according to some myths. He is also the patron of Memphis, the ancient capital of Egypt, where his temple was located. Ta is the husband of Batet and the father of Nefertum, the god of perfume. Thoth, the god of writing. Thoth is the god of writing, wisdom, magic, and science. He is depicted as a man with the head of an ibis or a baboon holding a writing palette and a pen. Thoth is credited with inventing hieroglyphs and writing many sacred texts that contain secrets of the universe. He is also the scribe of the gods who records their deeds and judgments. Thoth is often associated with Mat, the goddess of truth and justice. Mat, the goddess of truth. Mat is the goddess of truth, justice, order, and harmony. She is depicted as a woman wearing a feather on her head or as a winged goddess. Mat is the daughter of Are and the wife of Thoth. She represents the cosmic order that governs the universe and the moral principles that guide human society. She is also involved in the judgment of the dead, as her feather is used to weigh the hearts of the deceased against their deeds in life. 